Hello, friend. The Unity Movement was founded 131 years ago based on the power of prayer. Prayer is the most important thing that we do. In prayer, we access divine wisdom. And I know that you've been engaged in that activity as you have selected the candidates for whom you choose to vote. Through prayer, we access the energy and the vibration of our desire fulfilled. And I'm sure you're engaged in that as well. From prayer, we take guided action. And I know that all of you have either already voted or you will between now and November 3rd. Finally, as a prayer, we surrender to God's will for our country and for all humanity. And when we come into prayer together, the energy and the consciousness of that prayer is magnified. As we are reminded where two or more are gathered, there is the presence of God. So let us join in prayer. Let us join in a vision of our oneness as a country and as one human family. Let us also affirm and trust that healing is already taking place through the very activities that we're involved with. Each day until election day, we will be sharing this video and prayer at 6.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Our prayer chaplains will also be holding space with us at that time as we join Silent Unity, our movement's prayer ministry, and really the whole of the Unity movement in recognizing and affirming God's presence in our elections. So come, be a part of the consciousness. And as you do all that is for you to do specifically, let us add prayer to the way in which we walk our talk. Join us in this consciousness as we set the space for a greater healing to take place. In this election time, we pray in the knowledge that all candidates are being called to the highest purpose, to serve our cities, states, and nation with integrity, compassion, and commitment. We affirm wisdom and foresight for our leaders as they resolve challenges and help create prosperity and well-being for all people. We envision harmony, compassion, and inclusivity in all results. Together we stand for truth, understanding, and peace. Remembering all that unites us, we are guided forward to lift the energy of our nation and allow love to triumph. And so it is. Amen.